the square enix. <laughs> it already looks fucking gay. Could the music be any more fucking peaceful? I hope in this game somebody kills themselves. <laughs> Too bad I'll never make it that far. Get the fuck screen size. Director's commentary. What the fuck? Why would he set the default? Fuck. Large. Hella large. What the fuck? Kind of option lows. Did you know there's a fucking option in this game to have the subtitles? Hella large. Like how the fuck? I'm curious to know how big the fucking subtitles would be. Like would they be fucking huge? Cover up the whole fucking screen. Life is Strange Business Story Featured Player Choices. They always have to fucking say that in a game like this. Yeah, choose wisely when you can fucking rotate back time and fix your mistake. No, no. I didn't say choose wisely. God damn, what's with this shitty weather? It was so fucking peaceful. Famously called film little pieces pieces of time, Fuck. but he could be talking about photography as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I'm okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Sure. Because of her they images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Look. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. That's photographic news. It? And both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Oh, well, I have to hit more. we've all seen iconic shot of Kerouac on the balcony. And if you haven't, look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? Why the fuck is I can hear the class laughing at, at me now. Then? Why have the fucking arrow? And if you haven't, shame, shame. Capturing the romantic urban solitude of the 20th century poet. You dig? No, I don't. Now, know. pesky kids love so much. The selfie. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. <laughs> Modern take narcissism, they could go back hundreds of years. I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Speaking of Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. I thought I'd talk all the way until the bell rang. It's Why your turn to lecture us. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. 
Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Shit. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Well, now, Max, course. since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Why Louis Daguerre was a French painter who here. created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first I haven't American kept up with my journal as much as I should. By Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <sighs> Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. I can't... I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Holy shit. $5,300 for a piece of shit? And it's a fucking sure camcorder. It's like to be consultual event. And I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating. By putting yourself out what there in the world. To talk with fucking no matter who wins. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Boo. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Matt. Oh, totally. I only want to share whatever gifts I have. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too much. Look like you're about to fucking pass out. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. So you can do your fucking homework in your condition? What the fuck is going on here? Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Yeah, right. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Yeah, I'm gonna fall asleep during that too. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about I'm to. Not paying you Welcome to the real cute. world. Just cute? Hi. That I might send you a special picture of Jerry's in class. They're just getting you ready. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. What kind of fuck? plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that guy. He's so fucking boring. She's got to be the most dickiest fucking life. She's so fucking shy. Fucking music. Oh, it's kind of some fucking music. It's kind of fucking music you have to Who the fuck is my locker? Is this my locker? American I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous you. as usual. American girls, I'd like to. Be part of the world around you Driving a car by the seaside 
watching the world from the bright side. It looks like she's been gone for months. Why the fuck is there a missing girl post all fucking school? I don't get how you look like a fucking loser. I wish I had. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> it seems like it's so fucking normal for, like, the girls' washroom where they always sit there and fucking cry. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Yeah, we already fucking know about that. I mean, I never see a Just fucking relax. guy go in the Stop bathroom torturing and, yourself. and fucking ball in his you eyes. You have out. a gift. Unless he's Fuck getting it. his ass handed to him and he got it swirly. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. What's that say? I hate your cheese. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like bathroom? this every day. Take the fucking photo! Guy in fucking tickets wash. Take a photo of him. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. No, so Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. Why is he in the women's washroom? So what want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am or who oh you're messing God. around with! Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to Take do! A photo of I'm it. so sick of people trying to control me! You it's know you're get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa! What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in Why the bathroom. In the he shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. As he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us. In I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now to Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Oh, no. Shit. Can you give me an example of a photographer who captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless fake. Time wasn't that fucking far back. I did now, it. Can you give I me actually an did it. A photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human, the human time machine. Black and white. Anybody? There's no way that she developed fucking. Max, don't freak out. Time power. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Fucking high. Why Arvis? Not during her fucking. Because of her. Keep it together, Max. Look at you. You feel like totally happen. haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and. When children. I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a 
selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? Can, you ask, you fuck the the can I save her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, fuck since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after Alice class. And I need time to save that girl. Types. The process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style that like a mirror. Quick. You were in now the bathroom totally when she fucking died. Zone. And then you're worried she's gonna Sad fucking face. die? Very good, Victoria. What if I were in the fucking bathroom yet? Yes. Give him the right answer. Find detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s on. Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes Contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. What the fuck? It's time to be an everyday hero. <laughs> what the fuck kind of teacher is this? You see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shop. Excuse me. Shit. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. You were there before! Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck Guy's I am bitch. or who you're messing around with! Where'd you get that? Your fucking cry. What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do! Wow, sir, it's happening sick. again. I'm trying to, to control die. me! You are going to get I'm too scared to get near this psycho. Drugs. Nobody would ever even miss sure. your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away I from need a hammer to break it open! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. No. If I can reverse time again, no, no, I can no, help her. Oh, sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever Fucking even bitch. miss your punk ass, would they? I want to see that again. Get away from me, psycho! Yeah. No. no, I was doing it. Sick! Get that gun away from me, psycho! Yeah. Oh. Yeah.
missed your punk ass, would they? Here it is. Get away from me, psycho! <laughs> the one time I found a random uh, marker, so I went in the bathroom and tried to draw Squidward, but it turned out to look like a fucking dick. <laughs> psycho, oh man! Bitch down! Bitch down! Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. What? You're just gonna let him keep the gun? Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just uh, saw a girl get happen. shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Rachel. Do not freak out. What the fuck does that say? Rachel is a real bitch? Someone writes that in the fucking bathroom stall. Is that the girl who's gone missing? And her name's on the fucking hey. bathroom stall. Do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Is huh? everybody in this high school? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and it. please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Was Principal, it's a black principal. Won't do it. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I'll report him. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You Why sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. Yeah, I Prescott. saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family, and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. Well, why don't you check him so for what a fucking next? weapon, then, asshole? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's yeah. it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. See, this is why no one fucking talks. Of course talks, this academic drone won't do anything group. since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? You won't be able to change your choices after that. I don't fucking care.